friends welcome to my channel today in this video we are going to make a beautiful hat for girls i am going to use yarn of two colors and the hook of 4.5 mm for this project so we are going to begin with yarn of color a and red slip knot Now we have to do chain 1, 2, 3, 4. We have to go back to the first chain, insert the hook in, yarn over, pull through both the loops with a slip stitch. Chain 1, 2, 3, which counts as a double crochet. Insert the hook into the ring, pull through, pull through 2, pull through 2, double crochet 2, 3, Four, five. To complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed. Then we have completed 16 double crochet into the ring. We have to join the stitches into the first, second, third chain of the first stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the first stitch, chain one, two, three, which counts as a double crochet. On the top of the same stitch, double crochet, 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. Into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. Into the same stitch, double crochet 2. So we have to do 2 double crochet on the top of each stitch across the round. Complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed. When the round is complete, we have to join the stitches into the first, second, third chain of the first stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the first stitch, chain 1, 2, 3, which counts as a double crochet into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet yarn into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet yarn. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet yarn into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet yarn. Follow the same pattern and complete the round. We will meet again when this round would be completed. After the end of the round, we join the stitches on the top of the 4 stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the 4 stitch, chain 3, which counts as a double crochet, into the same stitch, double crochet 2. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1 into the same stitch double crochet 2 now on the top of next two stitches one double crochet double crochet 1 into the next stitch double crochet 1 follow the same pattern and complete the round we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet on the top of the next stitch, double crochet one, one double crochet on the top of the next stitch, one double crochet on the top of the next. So we have to do one double crochet on the top of each stitch and keep on increasing the pattern in the same way to the length you require for the project. We completed one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15 rounds. After the completion of these rounds, we did this pattern with beautiful bow on the top of this hat. So these curls we have to begin with slip knot. Now 1, 2, 3. 
into the fourth round insert the hook in pull through pull through two now we have to do chain 20 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 and 20 skip two chains into the next one insert the hook in pull through pull through all the three a half double crochet into the same stitch insert the hook and pull through pull through all the three into the same stitch insert the hook and pull through pull through all the three into the next stitch three half double crochet one two and three into the next stitch three half double crochet one two and three follow the same pattern and complete the row we will meet again when this row would be completed when this row is complete we have to join the stitches into the same stitch with slip stitch now we have to do chain 20 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 and 20 skip two chains into the next stitch three half double crochet one two three into the next stitch one two and three so follow the same pattern and complete this row and two more rows following the same pattern and we will meet again when these four curls would be completed when all these four curls are complete we are going to make bow for the top of these curls so for this we have to switch to yarn of color B and we have to begin with slip knot now we have to do chain 9 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 skip the fourth chain into the next stitch single crochet 1 2 into the next 3 4 5 6 7 8 chain 1 turn the work now we have to do 8 single crochet on the top of 8 stitches 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 so these are 2 rows we have to do 3 more rows so complete three more rows and we will meet again when these five rows are complete when these five rows are complete we have to cut the yarn from here now with the help of needle and thread we have to wrap the yarn in the middle of this bow Now we are going to stitch this bow on the top of the curls. So put this bow on the top of the curls and stitch this in this way.
now our hat is complete this hat is going to look like this when it will be completed this hat is fit for the girls from the age of 6 months to 3 years this hat looks pretty and can be a very good gifting option too thank you so much